Hey guys, Trev here from Norwood Sawmills. I want to talk to you today about something that's crucial when you're milling, and that's proper blade tension. Uh, we've put together a patented design on ours that we feel is super user friendly. So what I want to do is go through the process with you so that uh, basically everybody's on the same page as to how this function works and how you can make it work for you. When you're working with our machines, what you want to do is you want to turn the T-handle. It's a maximum from the point that the T-handle engages the spring of five full turns. That's full tension. Anything after that, all you're going to do is bend uh, items in your sawmill, okay? So what you want to do is cut maybe somewhere between four and five and find that uh, proper spot for you to work within. Now, when you're cutting and when you're tensioning, tracking is going to be part of that tension. So you're going to have to keep an eye on whatever you decide to run at as tension to get the proper cut. You're going to need to make sure that you're tracked properly for that tension. Your tension will affect your tracking, which is where your blade is going to lay in conjunction to your band wheel. And what you want is you want the gullet of the tooth to sit flush with the front of the band wheel. I cut at four and a half full turns, five as max, and you want to make sure that when you're set up for tension, you're tracked so that your blade is sitting flush with the gullet on the front of the band wheel, okay? 